Hello everyone, on this video we will see uh, so binary components so we will see analysis on binary components so last time we will try to calculate different components different parameters using aspect class and also we will try to see uh, pure substance component with respect to uh, other parameters just uh, we try to see changing the temperature and we try to see how the temperature change is affecting other parameters of some substances so also today we will see that um, some binary uh, analysis that means i uh, will see the dew and bubble point pressure uh, as function of the component mole fraction and also we will see the formation of azeotrope formation uh, so we will pick some uh, some uh, components and then we will try to do some analysis so let's go as usual let's go to new and so as usual so let's fit the component let's start with Acetone and ethyl ethyl ketan and also the third component will be hexane. So next, then let's select the uh, property method and now next and if something is missing so we can here we can select to estimate using unifar and also let me uh, run the properties let's run the properties and So then we can go to the binary and now we can we can plot uh, three different kinds of uh, graphs uh, so we can plot t a x y graph or p x y graph with pressure uh, x y graph uh, that means with given temperature we can plot temperature Y graph analysis with given pressure or also we can do uh, Gibbs energy of the mixture using uh, so to determine whether or not to uh, those uh, liquid fields will form at the given temperature and pressure or not so let's select our uh, components let's select hexane versus Hexane. Let's mix uh, two comp select two components. Uh, the first component we, you can take the hexane, and the second component you, we can take the ethyl ethyl ketone. And so we can uh, vary uh, maybe more in terms of mole fraction. So we can vary the mole fraction of hexane. So so uh, let's plot uh, PXY graph and so the starting point will be zero and the maximum mole fraction is of obviously one so we can see the in terms of the incoming and also we can uh, also see the in terms of the interval so uh, the temperature will be set at room temperature and let's try to see what will happen uh, for this analysis maybe we can easily see the other formation uh, and let's run this analysis now we can see liquid vapor mole fraction of hexane uh, the p x y graph and we can also see uh, where the 
and what amount of mole fraction the azotrope is forming. So we can see that at zero point eight, uh, at this point, the azotrope is forming. Also, at different points, uh, you can see uh, the x, y, uh, uh, x and uh, liquid vapor mode fraction at any point and so uh, so we can also change uh, see uh, uh, the t x y graph using uh, this binary analysis 